the objective of my theorem was to determine whether a stiffer spring or a more flexible or loose spring would result in a more elastic collision when impacted by a moving body. Um, so generally speaking, one of the goals of my lab was to determine whether a sort of softer material or a harder material would result in a more elastic collision. And of course, the change in kinetic energy due to a perfectly elastic collision is zero. So that's something you should you know, keep in mind. We're looking for the least amount of energy loss. We basically, use an aluminum track that was to elevate in order to create an, uh, an inclined plane. Uh, we have a motion sensor, the cart, and the left uh, right hand side of the screen. Then it, it's sort of a, it's a little difficult to see in this picture. That's actually the spring rig that I used. So the spring actually was stationary. It was the cart that would move and impact the spring. I tested 20 different masses and 20 different release heights for each spring, and I repeat each test three times and took an average. In general, at basically at lower speeds and for low, smaller masses, the percentage of energy lost was actually less with the loose spring.